Hi everyone, Phil here. The topic today is about setting up the equations to estimate to get the F test to test a linear restriction. So we've got multiple regression here, two explanatory variables. Just notice in terms of notation, uh, using X here to denote the dependent variable and Y is in the D for the explanatory variables doesn't really affect anything. I want to test this restriction. That's a beta 2 and that's a beta 3. So is that equal to 0? And to set up the F test we can estimate two models. One not supposing this is true and, what, and then after that estimate imposing this restriction. So the first one where we estimate it freely without any restriction, that is called, in the econometrics, it's called uh, the unrestricted model. And then the one that you impose the condition is called the restricted model. So you compare the RSS, you can compare the RSS between each to, to determine whether or not the null that this restriction is true. In statistical modeling, the first, the un, what the econometricians call the unrestricted model is sometimes called the full model and the one with the restriction is called the reduced model. So we're just going to do this bit right out of the form of the restricted regression model. In other words, imposing this constraint on this model. Uh, basically, it's just substituting the one of the parameters into here. We can do it two ways. Say we want to substitute out for beta 2. We're just taking this to the other side, have this constraint maybe written like this. So beta 2 is that, so just substitute for beta 2 in the original model with the constraint that. Next line is a common factor of beta 3, so that comes out. And what we note is that we have a new explanatory variable. We started off with a multiple regression model with two exponential variables but now notice we have now got a simple linear regression model this is my new exponential variable so it's just data it's called x star because d is remember it's just data variable one of exponential variables this y I put a star in it because I don't want to write out y star what well, I'm calling y star just this I don't want to you know write all that out again so yeah we have now got a simple linear regression model. On the other hand, if you decided to substitute for beta 3, just verify, just using a simple substitution, yet you get this expression. Now, these two are both restricted models and they are equivalent. To see why, look, beta 2, what is beta 2? It's this guy, substitute this guy into here and it's going to be equal to this. So now we've got the restricted model, what you'll do is if you have the data is to estimate this model, take the residual sum of squares from it, and then you could feed it into the F test to test whether this can, holds. All right. Uh, okay, that's it, guys.